Okay, gender bonus. <laughs> oh, pardon me. Um, it's Saturday again. Ugh. It's horrible. This thing has thrown me on my ass all week. Um, my throat doesn't hurt anymore. Uh, about a good, as good as it gets. Um, I'm coughing up a storm. Forever, and, uh, yeah. <coughs> Sorry about that. I'm sure that made a whole lot of noise. Um, yeah, so this week's topic, um, it's about socializing, making friends, um, uh, those of, like, your preferred gender, uh, your gender presentation, who you are. Um, side note, the one good thing about this cold is I've been passing, like, 70, 80, 90 percent, because my voice is... Uh, deeper because of it. Um, not complaining. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, back to the topic. Um, uh, like, bonding with, with those, uh, with males, basically, um, has not really been easy. Um, in the beginning of my life, uh, in early, early on, uh, all my friends were guys. Um, <clears throat> pretty much up until puberty hit, all my friends were guys, and even, even in, like, high school and after high school, the, the, the people who I did, I, like, I did the most with were, were guys, um, I, I had no problem making friends, or, well, being friends, I've always had problems making friends, um, Lately, all my friends have been females, like in college, um, for the most part, because I identified as a lesbian, so most of my friends have been, or are lesbians. But, um, I can say I've never really been comfortable in a large group of lesbians. Um, for example, going to, say, Ani Franco concert, I remember specifically going, uh, to one in Brooklyn. Uh, it was a park, it was lesbians everywhere, I felt so awkward, and sort of a feeling of, like, being found out, even though at that point in time, um, I really, I was identifying as a lesbian, so, I don't know what, what it was that I was afraid of being found out about, um, but, um, but as it comes to, like, like, making friends with guys right now, it's, not that easy, um, Scotty, uh, some of you may know, he's been on a few videos of mine, he's one of my roommates, I've known him since freshman year in college, so, I've known him for forever, uh, since 2004, um, so, like, and he was, he was one of my other roommate's friends, so, <coughs> So making friends, like, with him that way was was no big deal, but, like, if, if I'm to make, like, good friends with a guy right now that, sorry, man, that, uh, it's a little awkward. I mean, I, I work, the majority of the people I work with are male, um, are friendly, uh, definitely, but, you know, they see me as female, and... I don't know, I, it, it's really, it's, I, I've noticed it's very difficult to be one of the guys when you're not, you know, um, the guys see it that way, um, I'm not sure why, but whatever, I'm not gonna complain, um, I've been trying lately to make more, more trans male friends, um, I've been surfing the, uh, online forums and such, to do that, and I'm uh, putting forth a great effort, because I am horrible at making friends, period, um, yeah, um, as for, <coughs> as, I'm trying really hard not to call here, um, as for, uh, maybe post-transition, um, I, I don't really know, I, I am, I am, I have 
fears. I, uh, I'm afraid a little. Have anxieties, but you know that'll that'll happen when it happens. But I sort of have a feeling that that it'll turn into like the majority of my friends will be you know this the same as I have right now. Plus sub. Uh, Plus, uh, trans male friends, and I don't know, I'm hoping more more guy friends. Who knows? Um, so do I have anxieties there? Yes. Oh. <coughs> but, um, yeah. I don't know. I really don't know what's going to happen. Um, I'm trying not to think of it a lot. Because I'm already having anxieties about transition in the first place that I'm I gotta yell at myself about every time I, every time I think about. So, um, I, I just figured I'm, I've always had a hard time making friends. I probably will continue. Um, it's gotten better, but slow and steady, you know. Um, <coughs> that's, uh, that's really all I got for you this week. Um, I'm sorry I'm late again. I promise next week I won't be. It's really horrible. I'm so anti late. I'm so up with punctuality. It's it's bad. Uh so yeah. Now I have to I'm going back and laying in bed until I have to go to work. So I'll catch you guys next Friday. Or er, will be next Friday. Alright. <coughs> I'll catch you later. Bye.